what you did Yeah, I know, I know And I wanna talk about it And I know you don't I've been holding guard for so long, so long And I don't know where to start I don't know where to start now Tell me where you hide Where do you go? Tell me is she nice? She knows, I know Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello, my name is Nita. Uh, as you can see by the title, today I'm going to be packaging some orders, so it's going to be another studio vlog. Uh, I'm very excited because I've been waiting for this stuff to arrive for a couple weeks now. Um, so I'm excited it's finally here. So they are the like t-shirts and hoodies and stuff. So because the, this is my first lot of them arriving, um, usually I'm used to packaging like art prints so I've only had to deal with uh, like envelopes and stuff like flat things but now that I have the clothing pieces um, the packaging is going to be a little bit different to what I'm used to so I ordered some stuff online for like some ma mailer bags for the Clothes. They arrived a couple days ago. I haven't used any of them yet, so I'll show you guys what I got. Something arrived the other day and it was in this little compostable bag and I really liked it. And on the bag it had the website of like, you know, where it came from. So I went onto their website and they sold in bulk and the prices were really good. So I ordered from them, it came really quick, like only a matter of days. And yeah, I got two different sizes, but I'll show you what they are. So I got this, um, what is it, tissue paper from just eBay. I got 100 sheets. I think it was about maybe like $16 or something like that with free postage. So. That's pretty decent. I'll probably use one sheet per item of clothing. And then I got these compost packs. I'm a compost pack. So they came in packs of a hundred. And I think like for the small one, it was only like $22 or something like that which I think is really good because I'm pretty sure like the sallow bags that I put my art prints in are more expensive than these and these are like environmentally friendly so yeah there I'm a compost pack and this was this was the size that I received my thing in and I saw the website on the bottom and yeah so that was really cool I discovered that because I thought finding packaging was going to be a headache but because for my art prints it's been a headache I still am not like environmentally friendly with those I really want to do the same kind of thing um, like what is it compostable uh, art sleeves but that's a little bit more tricky to do because like with these it doesn't really matter they don't have to be see-through well they don't they don't have to be see-through <laughs> but as art prints you want them to be you know you don't see art I don't know what I'm saying you know what I mean <laughs> so these are the small ones 165 by 235 millimeters so I know that these are big enough just for a t-shirt yeah these are big enough for a t-shirt and then the bigger ones, I'm hoping the hoodies will fit. I'm pretty sure they will, but we're we're about to find out. These were, I can't remember if they like said they were small, medium, or large or anything like that. But the dimensions are 255 by 325 millimeters. So those are the two different sizes. T-shirts, hoodies. I just realized, what if someone orders two hoodies? <laughs> If someone orders two hoodies, I'll just cross that bridge when I get there. So yeah, this should be alright for now. So, we're about to find out together how this is going to go. So, I'm pretty sure I've got everything ready for like 
uh, to make the whole packaging process run smoothly. So I have here, these are all thank you cards, so this is half of them. I've just got them sitting here ready to go. And they're an A6 size. So I guess it's kind of like a complimentary print for you, for supporting my work. So it is A6, like these are the A5, so it's significantly smaller. But it's free, it's included in your order and you can still, you know, frame it if you want to. And on the back I've just written a little thank you note. Uh, I made that the other day, I'll show you. Yeah, I have thank you cards. I'll include a little business card um, in, in it. And then I've got the packing slip, the tissue paper, the little sticker, thank you sticker to seal the paper. And then, yeah, I, I print out the labels on Australia Post. So I just put it all in on the computer, all the addresses, details and stuff, print it out and then that's paid for online so I can just drop it off. I know um, depending on where you live you can like have your stuff ready to be picked up but unfortunately in the little town that I live in I have to take it, I have to take it into the post shop. I got popcorn in my teeth. So these are the Mama T-shirts. Mama. Some Kia ora T-shirts. You saw me wearing it in my last video if you watched my last video. Oh, sorry. Papa hoodies. That's so got Papa on the front. Just a hoodie. And then on the back, it's got the illustration. I'm going to get made some without the square to see how it looks. Because I do like the look of the square like on these. That's cute, but I'm not sure if I love, like I still really like this, obviously, but I feel like I want to see what it looks like without the square. Maybe I'll just keep the squares to the t-shirts, but we'll see. Thank you. Hmm, maybe change the colour of the square, because I like this. Also, I want to do some writing down the sleeves, because I do have that option. I just don't know what to write. Like, for the papa ones, I was thinking of writing papa, papa, like two papas. But then it would just look like papa, papa. Like, it would just be a lot of A's and P's. <laughs> so, I don't know. What do you think? Because I like the sleeve. Um... Because I have another hoodie and it's got the picture on the front 
like with these it's just got the word on the front but the hoodie that I have I'll post a photo it's got the picture on the front and it's got the writing down the sleeve and I really like it so I want to make my own versions of those so yeah some more purple hoodies oh how cute Mama. The Mama hoodie, what have I got? Mama hoodie, Papa hoodie. Isn't that just so cool? Love it. And there should be one more kind of hoodie. So that's a little self love club mermaid. Ah, oh, that's so cute. These hoodies are so soft and comfy. I'm obsessed with them. So let's get into it. So I have Shopify. And I have it on my phone, I have it on my iPad, and I just can open it on my laptop like on a normal web browser. But as an app, it's really cool because when someone makes an order, then like this cha-ching sound notifies you. Like, you know, when you get a text, text and it dings, or when you get an Instagram something, it has its noise. Shopify has a cha-ching sound, and it's so satisfying. <laughs> I'm going to show you what I do. So, I have some outstanding orders here. All orders. So I'm going to scroll down to the beginning because those are the first ones that have ordered the hoodies. There is archived, which means I've fulfilled it. There's unfulfilled, which means I haven't fulfilled it at all. And then there's partially fulfilled, which means I, yeah, self-explanatory. I've sent out part of the order, but the part that hasn't been sent out yet is just the clothing pieces, like. When people order prints, they go out straight away, or notebooks or stickers, or pretty much everything else in my store, just not the clothes. So, this person, they ordered a large Kyoto tee. Yeah, so she ordered a print, a chorus sticker, and a t-shirt. So, mmm. <laughs> I'll just show you. Large. I'm obsessed with this t-shirt. I love it. Do you want to see what I'm doing? I print the packing slip. So I've got the packing slip, I've got the thank you card, I've got the business card. Then I'll just print out the shipping label, stick it there. I also have some other little labels like return labels just with my address and logo on them. I'll probably just put it across there. Hopefully those arrive by like tomorrow or something. I'm going to print all of the, what's it called, shipping labels at the end at the same time. So I just got these little post-it notes. So I'll just write the name and then I'll come back to the shipping labels soon. Is that done? It's all trial and error guys, i got to figure out what's the best way of doing things and you're watching me learn as I go. Alright, next. 
Self Love Club hoodie. Do you like my cup? Ah, in my jumper. I got them from Niagara Falls. So I went to Niagara Falls and it was really cool. And I got this cup. I think it's a star, I think, I know. I know it's a Starbucks cup. And then I went to the Harley store at Niagara Falls and I got this. <laughs> so cute. All right. So it fits like the the dimensions, but because it's so high, I'm a little bit stressed. It's gonna be alright. Positive thinking. So I've got the packing slip, the thank you card, the business card, which by the way, they're not like out of date, but I have got updated ones on the way because when I first made them, I had my Gmail email. <laughs> Gmail email. And I feel like I didn't look professional, professional enough. So I set up my hello at winning to email. So now that's all my new business cards that are coming. And yeah, moment of truth. Uh, okay, so it's a bit of a squeeze. The other one wasn't as much of a squeeze. Actually, I think I might just. I'm going. Oh, I'm ready for the sticker. On. Let's try that again. just not going to be flawless you know what I mean like it's gonna be a little bit stretched and a little bit crinkly but good thing it's just a hoodie like it's fine absolutely will not fit two hoodies <laughs> but this is a good start for now I'll just order a bigger one for bigger orders Let's just hope they have bigger ones. Ones? Bigger, what are they called? Compostable bags. Packs. Pack. We're halfway there. <laughs> when you watch this and then you receive your package, you're going to appreciate the effort gone into just simply putting it in the bag. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh yes, we can do that. Oh yeah. <laughs> Yay. Ooh. Okay, that looks really good. There's still a good amount left at the top to close. Oh, what an absolute fluke. Put it in. I just don't want the corner of the card because the card's quite stiff to like rip the bag, you know. Ah, oh, would you look at that? I'm designed to be used again. Please cut here so that you can reuse me. That's cool. 
I didn't actually notice that when I got my one. It went in the bin. Now I feel bad. If you have a store, a store, a shop, if you sell things, if you send things to people, like if you package things and send them, you will understand the satisfaction of this. <laughs> ah, it's just so satisfying seeing it all come together. Do I need this? No. My space is so small and awkward, but it's getting the job done for now. In, in a little while I can look back at how far I've come because, you know, naturally I'll grow to, I don't even know what I'm saying, shut up. This person got a hoodie, oh, huh, you can see me. Uh, this person got a hoodie and a t-shirt. Huh. I'm just going to have to use what I have of these because this is all I have left. I'm not going to buy any more of these because these are plastic and these are not good for the environment and I'm going to buy some bigger ones of these but in the meantime because we all know that a hoodie and a t-shirt is not going to fit in here. So I'm going to have to yeah, put these here for now. You heard what I just said. Alright, so extra large papa hoodie and a medium mama tea. I've got a small box to get through and it's just going to be repetitive. If you enjoyed that studio vlog, feel free to subscribe and like my video just because it helps me out a little bit. I don't usually say this because um, I just I feel weird asking you to, but it's YouTube. So yeah, subscribe if you enjoyed, like if you want to. And thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!